Thank you so much. Zirudin, the Vanai Zimbabwe. As you all know, that Trugungo, Ruana, Ruana, and information and so forth. It's very sad uh, that the spokesperson for ZANU PF has all of a sudden become the spokesperson for Triple uh, C Shabang. Yeah, life goes on like that. That uh, the Triple C Shabang has got. Uh, uh, Chris Mchangwa is the spokesperson for the part. <laughs> uh, so, unfortunately, he has issued a death threat to President Nelson Chamisa. Um, he has uh, uh, threatened to deal with the President Chamisa, accusing President Chamisa of fraud. Six million people missing. Unose unose ogarwa chido manimba ama murizwacho uno mo na nekuchema. They are now creating all sorts of stories. In 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 shaba ngustenua claiming or self imposition as a secretary general of Triple C. He has never even a day. Challenged the president Nelson Chamisa on any missing funds in the party. Uh, to make matters worse, Zanu PF uh, or Shawang spokesperson Chris Mchangwa pretends as if he doesn't understand the dynamics of politics. Uh, that if you have got a political party, the funds, the political funds are not held by the president. Uh, we might ask Shawang where this, this 6 million went because he's the person who received that man if he was the Secretary General of the party. <coughs> All the resources of a, a political party are channeled through the Secretary General of a party. So if you pretend that you were, or if you claim that you were the Secretary General of the party, that means you are the person who received every every support that the party needs because that is the duty of a secretary general the treasurer will keep the books to say look i've received so much money but it will be channeled to the secretary general the secretary general will be the one distributing which six million are we talking about it's chris mchangwa sorry what a flow how are you it's chris mchangwa who Say Dan's six million is missing with triple C. Uh, so if there is six million pounds, US dollar or whatever, 
missing triple C, we need to ask the Secretary General, we need to ask the Treasurer, if these positions were ever available in the party. And uh, Caleb Rupere is really saying, Saka, <coughs> because of that, ZANU PF has been issuing death threats to President Nelson Chamisa. Uh, I don't know where ZANU PF is getting into in this puzzle or, or in this uh, uh, situation. Uh, I don't know where ZANU PF is finding its muscles. Uh, to intervene in whatever is happening uh, in that uh, sinking triple C ship. As, <laughs> so we don't know where that 6 million uh, came from. Uh, a lot of people are quizzing. 6 million. Then we have got uh, uh, deployees. Obrigado, Marvin White. Zurizem on my tower. I go to the Onufunga to take a pussa. Yeah, they think we could test it like a pussa. Sayo. Some people, you know, now what surprises me is if you look at Chris Mchangwa, if you look at him, you might think the gentleman is clever. If you listen to him speaking uh, the Anglo Saxon language, you might think, yes, we have seen the most clever or the most educated man in Zimbabwe. Uh, then if you now uh, listen to the sense of those words, or to the meaning of whatever he is trying to convey to the people of Zimbabwe, this is when you see, oh dear, <laughs> he is miles away from being, from, from being wise. There is no wisdom in everything that the gentlemen say. And surprisingly, Zanupiev keep him as the spokesperson of ZANU PF or whatever, and as uh, all of a sudden image to be the spokesperson of uh, uh, Shabahangu. Chabangu. So, no, no, it's a good job. Yes, yeah, at the floor, yes, that is 100% right. Plus, this is why you see a lot of degrees from the uh, University of Zimbabwe or so are being condemned because. If you think would could Muchangwa is a graduate, then you you begin to do a soul searching to find out how did he manage to pass his degree. Do you see Pano Gara if you look behind me? I've read all those books. I'm trying to get rid of them. Some of them are very important books that I need to send to Zimbabwe. But to be honest with you, I've read all of these books. Ningata or a broken English, but I've read all these books. These books were written by renowned authors. I can write my own book. I've learned everything. I've read all those books behind me. So apana mna no doubt at my degrees now. And swung less is how are you? How are you, my my Zuru Fumber? I did a Jenny. Ah, Jenny Kapua, my sister. How are you? How are you, my tete? So, I've, when I was studying, I used to go to the library. I used to do lives on Facebook whilst I, would be, whilst I would be in the library. I used to show people our library. I used to tell, show you, telling you that, look, guys, I'm writing this assignment. And I used to show you all my results for my assignment. You can't doubt where I got my degrees from. You can't doubt where I got all my four degrees from. They came from reading these books, writing assignments, making uh, uh, making presentations. Kuchkoro, nishimaki rounds ya wa research wa gona and idumuruona. But uh, if you listen to me talking, I give you facts. I don't come with opinions. I come here with the facts. As few, hello, Mkoma Shapiro. How are you, Sibs? Mzaya, wanaswa na wasukuru. Zuri se ishumba. So you see, uh, if you listen to Chris Mchangwa, there are quite a lot of questions that will cross your mind. Is this gentleman a genuinely a, a, a degree holder, or a diploma holder, or a certificate holder? 
So he has turned himself into Shavangu spokesperson. And over representation, Peter, um, well, thank you, my brother. Thank you so much. As Mlongo Anga, Tilitese, Mkondo, Ikwese, Kwese, Trenda, Nachamsa, thank you, Atete. Thank you so much. Along Wam, Wanga, thank you so much. So, what I'm saying here, it's a, it's a clear lesson, gentlemen. That is, ZANU PF is coming in now, is threatening President Chamisa with the death. They were saying the gentleman is weak. They, they said a lot of things about Nelson Chamisa. A lot of things about Nelson Chamisa. And Chamisa is quitted. And they are up in arms. Why Chamisa is quitted? Because Chamisa quitted this uh, uh, polluted triple C. It's a polluted political party. You can't live in that sewage. You can't sing in the sewage. Once you think that this boat is sinking in sewage, then you can't sink in there. There is heavy uh, pollution. It's polluted. This is the reason why uh, President Chamisa had to, to quit. Chamisa is a brand. It's a brand that cannot associate with the traitors. You cannot destroy your brand. Work with the traitors. You can do that. You can risk, you risk, you can risk your brand. Ujishanda, nema, 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 nema traitors. So this is why you see now, President Chamisa has quit uh, the sinking ship, the triple C, for political reasons. For political reasons. This is the gentleman that has enjoyed the resilience he has enjoyed resilience. Chamita, Chamisa has the ability to bounce back after getting knocked down. He was, he was knocked down on several occasions. That's what Zoka Tangatans gonna new to life. Thanks, honest. That Zoka Monoma. Facebook and I got for three months. So I'm back now. Sagandango Titi Batakanda, my life, you are. Baba Yuda, happy new year. Ah, Rovin, iti, uti, uti, nchomi wami. Ah, happy new year, mwana wama. Zirufu ambaye. 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 Zirufu with the ability to bounce back after getting knocked down. They knocked him down whilst he was in MDC Alliance. He was in MDC T. He was the leader of MDC T. Then he went on to lead MDC Alliance. Then the MDC T, they knocked him out. They said it belongs to uh, Tokozani Kupe. Then he formed MDC Alliance. They knocked him out. And they said it belongs to Douglas Monzora and Tokozani Kupe. He formed Triple C. They knocked him out. They are saying it belongs to Shabahangu. So this resilience in Chamisa, I wish I had this resilience. He has bounced back after getting knocked off from all those organizations that he, he formed. It is simply, Chamisa simply refused to give in or give up. Because he has, he, he has uh, made this uh, organization. He has formed these organizations. Ziri se mko magiza. Ziru fambe. Anamo zenyika baba. Doku gazirisa wa shuruku ita guys. Ini, ewa za, na shita wana nevanu. Since President Chamisa Vaita quit from Triple C. Foni yangu, yanga ichi receiver. I was receiving calls every minute i was receiving about 60 calls in an hour and in the morning so the rate of calls that i was receiving people wanted me to give them an explanation and the people are eager to know what is the next move after president chamsa has quit triple c Warume. Uh, let's all rally behind the president Nelson Chamisa. Let's make a declaration that I will stand with Chamisa. Why I'm going to discuss this tonight 
why Zimbabweans must stand with the President Nelson Chamisa. This is our discussion tonight. And that allegiance we have given President Chamisa is the allegiance that has led uh, ah, Jeremiah Mzuru, Ruse, is the allegiance that has made ZANU-PF wish or issue dead threat to President Chamisa. They are saying, look, we knocked you down of MDCT. We knocked you down of MDCA. We knocked you down of Triple C. And you are still standing. So they are trying to test his resilience to see how this man bounces back uh, to stand again after losing everything. 